Hi there. Welcome to Sir Matigo channel. Today I would like to discuss the six trigonometric ratios. The six trigonometric ratios are taken from the right triangle. Let's have this right triangle ABC. Angle C is a right angle. The diagonal side is called the hypotenuse, which is side C. The side opposite to angle A is side A. We call it the opposite side. The side adjacent to A and C is side B. We call it adjacent side. We also denote angle A as theta. From this triangle, we name the six trigonometric ratios. Number one. Sine or sine theta is opposite over hypotenuse, that is A over C. Number two, cosine theta is adjacent over hypotenuse, that is B over C. Number three, tangent theta is equal to opposite over adjacent, that is A over B. These three ratios we can easily memorize by using mnemonic device and we call it as SOKATOWA. This is our device to immediately memorize these first three trigonometric ratios. SO stands for sine opposite hypotenuse. KA stands for cosine adjacent hypotenuse. TOA stands for tangent opposite adjacent. That's SOKA TOA. Number four, we have cotangent. Cotangent theta is adjacent over opposite. That is B over A. Let's compare cotangent and tangent. We notice that Cotangent is a reciprocal of tangent. We can rewrite cotangent as 1 over opposite over adjacent. And it is 1 over tangent theta. Next, we have number 5 second theta is hypotenuse over adjacent. That is C over B. Let us compare this also to cosine theta, which is adjacent over hypotenuse. So second theta is a reciprocal of cosine theta. We write 1 over adjacent over hypotenuse. And this is 1 over cosine theta. The last one we have cosecant theta is hypotenuse over opposite. That is C over A. Let's compare this also to sine theta. Cosecant is a reciprocal of sine theta. That is 1 over opposite over hypotenuse. And this is 1 over sine theta. Let's have examples. Given this triangle with angle theta, the hypotenuse is 5, the opposite is 3, and the adjacent side is 4. Sine theta is 3 over 5. Cosine theta is 4 over 5. Tangent theta is 3 over 4. Cotangent theta is 4 over 3. Secant theta is 5 over 4. And cosecant is 5 over 3. If we are asked to find the angle theta, we have sine theta is equal to 3 over 5. Theta is equal to sine raised to the negative 1, 3 over 5. Let's use the calculator to find theta. In the calculator, press shift, sine, and input 3 over 5. Theta is equal to 36.87 degrees. That's the angle. We can also use the other trigonometric ratios to find the angle theta. 
I am advising you to download the scientific calculator. Let's have another example. Given this triangle below, given side is uh, B equals 8.4, the angle is 36 degrees. We are going to find the length of A and C. To find A, we will use tangent. Tangent 36 degrees is equal to A over 8.4. A is equal to 8.4 times tangent 36 degrees. To find the value of tangent 36 degrees, we use the calculator. The value for A is 6.1. Now let's find C. C is our hypotenuse. We can use either cosine or second. Let's try cosine. Cosine 36 degrees is 8.4 over C. C is equal to 8.4 over cosine 36 degrees. This value using the calculator is equal to 0.5. This type of problem contains a triangle with only one side given and an angle. To solve this type of problem, we can use any of the six trigonometric ratios, whichever is applicable.